Hello everyone, so in this video, I'll be showing how to plot heat map for the mobile cellular data uh, that I have uh, obtained from uh, the STIPS course that is a free course that is offered by SAS. So to describe this data briefly, uh, this shows the number of mobile network connections uh, for different countries and regions um, and also for different income groups over time. So to plot a heat map, you open the graph builder from graph and uh, in the graph builder menu uh, you can uh, drag and drop uh, uh, regions as a y variable and then here uh, as the x variable and then here uh, you can add drag and drop mobile as a color variable so by default you can see heat map has been plotted now let's say you want to uh, look at the heat map for different countries uh, you can do that by just replacing the uh, y variable here uh, to country however the plot that you're seeing here is very difficult to read and not exactly informative so you can improve this by uh, adding a local data filter so to open a local data filter you you choose the red triangle option here and you say local data filter and then here you can add region as a uh, uh, data filter now uh, if you choose the different regions you can see the heat map changes oh by the way if you see any white space that means uh, the data is not available so now if you switch between uh, different regions you can see within uh, the different regions uh, how the uh, mobile network connections changed over time for different countries within these regions so this uh, uh, heat map is actually quite informative because uh, you can see that uh, even in uh, like different regions, uh, different countries, uh, you can see that this, uh, for example, Switzerland uh, seems to have got uh, network connection uh, much sooner than some other countries like Azerbaijan. And uh, similarly, uh, you can see something similar in the other regions as well. And depending on your requirement, uh, you can make other changes uh, and you can say done. Oh, let me also show you how to change the color. So by default, Jump uses this uh, blue to red uh, color scheme, but you can actually change this by right clicking on the, uh, the heat map gradient here. And then you can choose gradient. And then under color theme, you have different options. And let's say you choose white to orange. Uh, which might be easier to see and then you can say okay so now uh, you can see it's much more easier to see and once you're done you can say done and once you're done uh, you'll still see that the local data filter is here so you can still you know switch between uh, the different regions